everybody, welcome back to another great episode of Joshua Pro's Academy SQL Unlocked series. I'm Bali, here with me is Rick. Rick, how are you doing? Well, uh, good, thanks for having me back in your studio. Good to have you back too. So today we'll be, we're going to be talking about subqueries. Basically, basic subqueries is our topic today. Uh, first of all, the, what is basic subqueries, Rick? Well, basic subqueries is probably the easiest thing we're going to cover, but I like to cover it because people often say subqueries, and there's basic subqueries, which are really easy, and correlated subqueries, which come in a lot of flavors and options. But we're going to just knock basic subqueries right out of the park in one five-minute demonstration. All right, let's get into it. Let's get to the demo. Okay, well, look at my screen here. Now, what I want to do is I want to limit this to like saying equals employee two. Well, but instead of doing equals, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use in. In is like equals, but you can pick many of them. I can say instead, because I can't say equals two and three, I'd have to say in two and three. So in is like a precise operator, but I can use multiples. Now, here I've just decided to use employee two, but I could also add employee three. And you see, I easily, whatever I put inside this parentheses is now a part of the criteria, and it's looking for employee two, three, or four. And you know, I can go on and I can add as many of these as I want. And let's just, let's just leave it at this. This is, you know, uh, employee two, three, four, five, seven, ten, and eleven. It's really powerful. Mm -hmm. Now, what if that list was a query? See, that list can be something I hand typed in those parentheses or it can be a number, another query. Now, what I want here is I want to find all the employees who have found grants. So I'm going to the grant table and say, how many different employees appear in the grant table? Because everybody who's gone out and done something for charity, I want to award them with some special lunch mm -hmm. for going out and using your spare time for the betterment of our community. So people like you, I want to reward. So here we go. I'm putting this entire list, and you can see what this list has. Two, three, four, five, seven, 10, 11. That same list I had hand typed, yep. I don't have to hand type. Just put that query inside of here. Boom. And there, gives yeah. you your final result. So a basic subquery can only be used as criteria in an in statement. Hey Rick, that was some really great demo. I think so everybody now understands how powerful a basic subquery can be. Uh, what we're gonna do is next time we're gonna cover correlated subqueries and get a little bit more deeper into it, right? Mm -hmm. All right, thanks for joining us. Until next time, see you. Thank you.